hi guys in this tutorial I'm gonna show you how to fix you know this error the error that we get on Google Play Store while trying to download or update an app uh, that is unknown error code during application install uh, 990 okay so guys uh, I'm gonna show you a couple of methods and you can try that out and uh, let's see if this you know fixes your issue or not, okay okay guys so method one we have is uh, you have to clear the cache and data of Google Play Store Google Play Services Google Services Framework and download manager okay guys and if you don't see a Google Services Framework or download manager then you just leave it and just clear the cache and data of Google Play Store in Google Play Services okay and guys after that uh, you also need to remove your Google account and re-add it again so if you have more than one Google account associated then you have to remove every account okay so, okay guys so I'm gonna show you how you can do that okay so first of all you need to go to the settings of your home and find here apps or application manager so just tap over here I have apps and you have to swipe to the right to all tabs over here and find here a Google Play Store so here I have Google Play Store uh, just tap over here and then tap on clear data and then tap on ok as you can see it's now done ok and you have to go back and find here uh, Google Play Services just tap on it and then tap on manage space and then tap on clear all data and then tap on ok okay guys so it's now done just go back and find here Google services framework okay so here I have Google services framework just tap on it and then tap on clear data and then tap on ok and just go back and find here download manager so let me find that so here I have download manager just tap on it and then tap on clear data and then tap on ok and it's now done okay guys and after that you need to remove your Google account and we add it again. okay so let me show you how you can do that so uh, in order to do that you have to go to the settings of your phone and find here accounts so here I have accounts just tap on it and then tap on Google and then tap on Gmail and then tap on this you know three dots over here and then tap on remove account and then tap on remove account okay guys so it's now removed and uh, and guys also if you have more than one Google account associated then you have to remove every account okay and uh, after that uh, you have to you know open you know Play Store so you can also add your Google account from here uh, but uh, I'm just telling you how you can do that by opening Play Store just open Play Store as you can see it's checking info okay guys so just enter your email over here and then tap on next just enter your password uh, and then tap on next accept the terms of service and just tap on this arrow link over here at the bottom right and then tap on next uh, if you like you can set up a payment info but I'm just selecting no thanks and then tap on continue okay guys so after that uh, you just you know try to okay, let me get started try to you know download or update an app and let's see if this you know fixes your issue or not okay guys okay guys 
so you tried this you know method one and it doesn't fix this here issue then you have to try this method two so in this method two uh, you have to use another wi-fi okay okay guys also sometimes it could be due to isp issues if you are using 2g or 3g you know or 4g data packs then use wi-fi or if you are connected to the wi-fi then try to use another wi-fi network and try to install or update it Okay, so just try this method too and let's see if this fixes your issue or not, okay? Okay guys, so you tried this method too and it doesn't fix this your issue. So you have to try this method 3. So you have to check your phone memory, how much space is left, okay? So let me show you how you can check it. So you have to go to the settings of your phone and find here storage. So let me show you storage and uh, you have to find here you know the uh, available space okay so I have you know 5.82 gigabytes so you have to check it okay so sometimes the error 919 occurs due to insufficient memory so you have to uninstall correct it uninstall some apps that you are not using or try to move to SD card and after that you need to go to play store and try to install or update it okay guys so just try this method 3 and let's see if this fixes your issue or not okay guys so you tried this method 3 and it doesn't fix this your issue okay so you have to try this method 4 and in this method you have to change your apn that is access point name apn settings okay so in order to do that uh, you have to go to the you know the settings of your phone and here uh, you need to find here you know mobile networks or sim cards okay so i have you know sim cards over here so just tap on it you might have mobile networks and after that uh, you have to scroll down and find here you know i'm using dual sim so i have just sim one settings you might have sim settings so just tap on it and here i have this access point names okay so you just need to find this Okay, so just tap over here access point names and just try to use another you know access point and go to play store and also okay, and just restart your phone and go to play store and try to download or update it okay guys so just try this you know method 4 and let's see if this you know fixes your issue or not okay okay guys so that's it for this video thanks for watching and let me know in the comment section uh, whether it fixes your issue or not thanks for watching this video bye bye take care